Are you another prisoner of Mob Chathra? Must be a maiden from some land of hexagons. Don't worry, little hexagal. I'm gonna find all the other maidens and get us all out of here, okay? doesn't open. Looks like something horrible is in here. But what? won't open. Someone ought to fix that. I wish I knew how to fix that. This must be the room where they melt stuff. Locked or something. Still out of commission? Guess so. No, uh -uh. No, uh -uh. No, uh -uh. Seriously, who do they think they're fooling with this baby stuff? Seriously, who do they think they're fooling with this baby stuff? Someone ought to fix that. See? We're not in space, Dutch. I knew that. I'm the one that took this ship down, you remember? No, I'm the one that took it down. But let's not fight. Let's team up and take it down again to You don't believe I'm Shay? I'm leaving. Oh, I just don't know what to believe. I don't want to cut that.
That looks pretty heavy. Gruesome. Wait, is that real? Nice view. Both of them. Okay, that's definitely fake. Whew. A good knife is handy to have around. I don't want to cut that. I'm keeping these to myself. It's hard. I can't break up that debris with this knife. Looks like some sort of video game. These big surveillance screens don't seem to be working. That's the switch he used to unlock that door over there. Better leave it unlocked. I don't want to free this guy until I'm 100% sure about him. I've got to go. Get into the central control room. It's the only way to... I don't want to free this guy until I'm 100% sure about him. they keep in here looks like some sort of animal sleeps here Plenty of air. Oh, honey, we need to talk about your perfume. Thanks for choosing teleportation. You made my head bigger. No worry, sweetie, it's temporary. If you don't believe I'm Shay, I'm leaving. Oh, I just don't know what to believe right now. My son would understand that. Maybe. A good knife is handy to have around, even when it is kind of a creep. Hello in there. Who's out there? I can barely... I'll be right back.
I've got to go. It's a painting of what looks like a red boot. It says safety award, footwear category. Second place, shoe tying contest. I think I have all the clues I need. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. I think I have all the clues I need. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. Cute, but I wish they weren't bronzed. I can't tell what color they are. I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood. These people had giant monster spaceship technology before they perfected color photography. Looks like a note written by a little kid. Dear Shoe Fairy, thanks for the shoes. Aw, the red striped ones were cool and so were the green ones with skulls. But next year, could I please have red shoes with skulls? Please, please, please. Thanks, Shay. Sheesh, demanding. Looks like a note written by a little kid. Dear Shoe Fairy, thanks for the shoes. Aw. The red striped ones were cool, and so were the green ones with skulls. But next year, could I please have red shoes with skulls? Please, please, please. Thanks, Shay. Sheesh, demanding. I think I have all the clues I need. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. I'll bet someone was trying to knit socks and they ended up too long. And so, snake. I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood.
I wonder if he lost his first teeth by licking a moving beater, like I did. That train wreck looks like ominous foreshadowing to me. Shay's first space boots, age five. Cute, but I wish they weren't bronzed. I can't tell what color they are. clues I need. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. Looks like some sort of medical report. Metabot exam report. Patient continues normal healthy development. Unlike his first five years, this year has been marked by a remarkable growth spurt. In one year, he has grown two inches taller and gained three shoe sizes. Splarg therapy appears to be working. Splarg? Looks like a note written by a little kid. Dear Shoe Fairy, thanks for the shoes. Aw, the red striped ones were cool, and so were the green ones with skulls. But next year, could I please have red shoes with skulls? Please, please, please. Thanks, Shay. Sheesh, demanding. Apparently, these people had giant monster spaceship technology before they perfected color photography.
I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood. Shay's first space boots, age five. Cute, but I wish... Hello in there. Who's out there? I can... Do I say... If you don't believe... Hey, Mel. Hey, Mel. Here goes nothing. Make sure to give me a five-star review, okay? Now it's even bigger. Hi, it's me. And the size? Size three. And the pattern? Polka dot. Oh. Oh, I... I think I need to do some more research. I just know the answer's in here somewhere. Shea Volta. Best Actor, Purple Boots, the Musical. Looks like some sort of medical report. Metabot exam report. Patient continues normal, healthy development. Unlike his first five years, this year has been marked by a remarkable growth spurt. In one year, he has grown two inches taller and gained three shoe sizes. Splarg therapy appears to be working. Splarg? all the clues I need. I just have to put them together to fill out this chart. I wonder if he lost his first teeth by licking a moving beater, like I did. I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood. Apparently, these people had giant monster spaceship technology before they perfected color photography.
Shay's first space boots, age five. Cute, but I wish they weren't bronzed. I can't tell what color they are. Looks like some sort of medical report. Metabot exam report. Patient continues normal, healthy development. Unlike his first five years, this year has been marked by a remarkable growth spurt. In one year, he has grown two inches taller and gained three shoe sizes. Splarg therapy appears to be working. Splarg? Shea Volta, best actor, Purple Boots, the musical. Looks like a note written by a little kid. Dear Shoe Fairy, thanks for the shoes. Aw, the red striped ones were cool, and so were the green ones with skulls. But next year, could I please have red shoes with skulls? Please, please, please. Thanks, Shay. Sheesh, demanding. It's a painting of what looks like a red boot. First place, Hugging Marathon. It says, Safety Award, Footwear Category. Second place, Shoe Tying Contest. What a sad sack. Safety Award, Aquatics Category. Shay's first space boot. I wonder if he lost his first teeth by licking a moving beater like I did. I'll give this guy one excuse. He had a weird childhood. Hmm, doesn't look like he's going to grow up to be a kidnapper.
Hi. Purple. And the size? Size four. And the pattern? Polka dot. Oh. Oh. Shay, it is you. <gasps> You're not a computer. You're not Shay. Done to our ship. Where's my son? Who are you? And why have you been kidnapping girls with this ship? Are you insane? Where is the big mom computer that controls this ship? Mom computer? What, what are you talking about? My name is Bella Tartine. I shot down your ship. What? Why? We are an unarmed deep space vessel on a peaceful mission. The wolf told me about you. Okay, now just calm down. You need some help. You are not in space. Look at that window. Well, not anymore. You shot us down. No, you were never in space. It's all fake. The stars are on the inside. On the outside, you're a monster. But... She's right, my friend. There he is. That's the wolf I was talking about. That voice. Hey, why aren't you trapped under that junk anymore? I am no wolf, am I, Hope? I'm an old friend. <gasps> Marikai, what are you doing here? I'm here to finish Operation Dandelion for you. I'm sorry that we had to keep some aspects of the mission secret from you and your family. But... how are you... You said our world was dying. It was, but then you went forth and found our salvation, as so many have before you. The Mogs. Sorry about the outer space theatrics. Just a precaution to save you from the temptation to go native as some of your predecessors did we were never in space <laughs> no laruna is a great empire unto itself but is part of this very same planet beyond the plague dam funny you should mention that bella because here we are now while i prepare the ship for sterilization you two sit tight and relax. 
and know that you are contributing to the well-being of many generations to come. Captain! Up here! I'm a weapon! Hey, look! A fork! I'd have a full set if I could just find the... Oh, I wouldn't bring up the S-P-O-O-N if I were you. <gasps> Tiny here broke his heart, so he volunteered for a suicide mission. You shut your mouth, Dutch! Hey, don't worry. I won't tell him who you dumped him for. <sighs> Yikes. Glad to have you on the team. Anything to help out Captain Volta. This is a sweet picture. Yeah, it helps me remember. He wasn't always a teenager. Hey there. Hope? Vela, was it? Sorry I lied about being your son. The wolf said, well, I'm just sorry. It's okay. I don't blame you. Sounds like Marakai has been fooling all of us for a long time. So, I'm getting the feeling that you weren't behind all these kidnappings. What kidnappings? This ship. On the outside, it's built to look like a monster. <gasps> Every 14 years, a ship like yours comes to a village like mine. And we offer sacrificial maidens to it, so it won't destroy the town. It can't be. And then the monster, your ship, takes some of the maidens away forever. This all sounds so crazy. But it sounds exactly like the kind of scheme the Thrush would come up with. How can we get out of here? I locked the door manually before, but now I imagine Marakai's locked it himself. Our only hope is if there are systems he's overlooked. I'm going to find a way out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try to think of a way too. 